Welcome to your fifth Reimagined 2020 Family Creatives How To video, brought to you by Artcore and Wrong Sample. Meet Connie, a brilliant theatre designer and artist who will guide you through how to film your creation. We can't wait to see the fantastic puppet theatre and action you've created, with your filmed pieces being brought together in a music video premiere. Coming soon! To film your creation, you will need a phone or camera that can record video, your puppet theatre, your puppets, your set pieces and any other props you might need to share your story. You can film outside or make a set anywhere, but when filming the action in your puppet theatre, it helps to film it on a flat surface. A table where you can stand behind your puppet theatre is ideal. Lay out your puppets and props on each side of your puppet theatre. Puppets and props appearing from the left should be placed on the left. Those appearing from the right placed on the right. Other appearing puppets and props can also be placed behind your puppet theatre. You can film with either a camera or a phone. Position your device in front of the puppet theatre on the flat surface. You might want to lean it up against something sturdy so it doesn't wobble. Some phones and cameras let you see what you are filming whilst you do it. This can be really helpful. But if you can't do that, remember to check what you can see through the camera before you start filming to make sure everything can be seen. If there's someone there who can help you with this, ask them to check the camera for you. Make sure you film your creations in landscape. So, this way, not this way. That's it! Like a widescreen movie. Roll your sleeves up, you don't want them getting in the way. Also, if you have long hair, you might want to tie that back too. Rehearse! Have a practice, film it and watch it back. Then you can see what works and what doesn't? Change things until it is right. We want to see just your puppet theatre and your puppets in the frame. Make sure just your puppet theatre box is in shot, backgrounds distract from the action and we want all eyes on your show. So keep your head, shoulders and face out of frame. Make sure the light is in front of your puppet theatre box. You can experiment with torches, lamps, fairy lights but usually daylight works very well you can always ask someone to help you puppeteer and make a show together have fun when sending us your filmed creations you can send one continuous film that means a film which doesn't stop until the action is finished or you can send us a series of shorter filmed creations and we can edit them together. To submit your films use the email address learning at derbytheatre.co.uk If your file is quite big we recommend using WeTransfer. You can find this for free online. Just drop your file into the box upload it and either email it to learning at derbytheatre.co.uk or get a link and include this in your email to us. Then we can download your film creations and edit them together into a music video. Ta-da! We hope you've enjoyed creating your very own puppet theatre, set, puppets and action in this family creative series for Reimagine. We look forward to seeing your filmed creations. Help decide the way the story is told. It's your story too. Let's reimagine together.